This paper presents an approach to training tensegrity robot locomotion with low dimension observations. This video will outline our simulation and hardware results. With a metric of speed maximization, we found that Mirror Descent Guided Policy Search, MDGPS, learned a much more effective locomotion policy than either the traditional control scheme Linear Quadratic Regulator, LQR, or a standard hard-coded manual policy. It can be seen that the smoothness and effectiveness of the simulated robot's locomotion increases drastically throughout the training process. To test the model's performance under limited sensory input, we trained it with an observation space of 12, 6, or 3 dimensions of acceleration data. Although the spherical tensegrity system is dynamically complex, we found that the policies trained with lower dimensional data still performed as well as the original. In investigating this, we found that while the robot still performed nearly as well when trained with purely gravitational acceleration data, the policy's success plummeted when given linear acceleration data without any knowledge of gravity. This hypothesis was also tested on six and three dimensional data with similar results. The greater success of the policy trained on gravitational data implies that the principal features required to enact successful locomotion can be derived from the orientation of the robot in space, independent of its dynamics and acceleration. In addressing the issue of rough terrain, we found that the discontinuous nature of the dynamics over an inconsistent surface rendered MDGPS ineffective. To solve this, we implemented Path Integral Guided Policy Search, PIGPS, in simulation, which can be seen to perform much better than MDGPS under these circumstances. We also applied our learned policy directly onto the TT4 Spherical Tensegrity Robot, designed and built by our own Berkeley Emergent Space Tensegrities Lab, and achieved preliminary results supporting the potential of our approach.